Hey guys, welcome back to Zelda Warfare and uh, our next campaign. We're here in the Lake Bed Temple. We, we need a name for this one. We're gonna. There's going to be a, a lashing. L the Lake Bed lashing. Yeah. Oh. I don't know who's gonna get it, but. Lake Bed laceration. <laughs> <laughs> there's a. Uh, oh, there's, I just beat you there. How about that? There's the, yeah. There's a bit of that. Um, uh, what's the score? What do we agree about the score? I'm pretty sure we're tied. I think we negotiated this. <laughs> negotiated. I think uh, this is a must-win territory for you. If you wanna, otherwise it's gonna, you know, we have to implement a rule. If somebody's ahead by so much, it's like a slaughter rule. Oh, oh end, okay. Pre and prematurely. Is that? A, oh, I think you just pulled the head there. <laughs> yeah, I'm winning. It's first one out of the room wins. So. Oh wow. Oh, just just barely lost. Well. All right. So thanks for watching, guys. <laughs> That's gonna do it for. <laughs> Uh, look at you. Pa I always pause. Oh, okay. Uh, this is great. <laughs> <laughs> We're changing our inventory there, huh? Yeah. I I hit one of them, and then I walk forward, and then Midna tells me to hit them. Yeah, yeah I, I love... That's a classic uh, two, 2000 Zelda move right there. Okay. <laughs> so how... um, What are your thoughts on the Lake Bed Temple? I think it's a, it's a pretty good dungeon, yeah. I think it's my favorite dungeon in this game. Yeah. I really like it, actually. I think it does a good job of... It has some of the... It's the complexity of your water-based dungeons, but they, it's also, like, simple. Like, it's unlike the Water Temple in Ocarina of Time, where you constantly have to be changing the state okay. of the water and going to check, where in this, it's like... It's it's a bit complex, but once you get the water going in one area, you don't have to go back and turn right. it off. So it's it's kind of in between that, and I think it, I think it, they kind of, you know, got the formula down really well for this dungeon. Yeah, yeah, I think I agree. I, I it, it is uh, like all the changes you make to the like the landscape with the water when you open the reservoirs, they're permanent changes. Mm -hmm. So there's no back and forth really. Uh, that being said, it is a very confusing dungeon. I think you still do have to go back to previous rooms and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. There's a lot of that actually. There's uh, uh, this. I think is the most complex dungeon in the in the game. Yeah. Or uh, confusing, complex. I don't even know if those are both the right terms, but relatively, yeah. Because I I still think compared to other games, it's it's fairly straightforward, but it does okay. stand out in this. Like, when you think of the Forest Temple, oh, I, you can't roll up the... I know, I know. I, <laughs> oh, you didn't do it there. I, I'm, I've done it so many times that I still do it, actually, occasionally, but... Okay. Uh, I forgot where to go. Th there's a lot of that. <laughs> uh, this dungeon is just so... Uh, yeah, it's complex and confusing. I think that's what we were talking about. <laughs> I only really have too hard of a time here in the beginning... Because it's it's a matter of, see they want they want you to go like you don't have to go out here where I'm going, mm -hmm. but they want you to go through every door you can see and see okay I can't go this way yep can't go this way and they want you to move the staircase like two times until mm -hmm. you finally go the right. final place you can go so so even that it's actually not as complex as you as as it makes it seem because you can only really go one, one way yeah, yeah. It, it encourages you to like realize. Oh, oh wait, wait! We gotta get treasure chest opening. This is a, this is a map. Oh boy! All right, you're, you're winning in maps now. I think it's the first map. <laughs> well, I re I remembered you had to turn the staircase twice, mm -hmm. and then you find a chest with a key in it, but I couldn't remember where. Okay. And they put it there. It's yeah, it's whatever. Yeah. There's, no, it, there's the key. I think it encourages you to try to like figure out, like I remember that area you just were it's like there's the 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 water wheel is in the way mm -hmm. but it's not moving and i'm like how do i get this to move and i remember when i was a kid i couldn't quite comprehend that fully all right okay not really a kid i was like 20 when this came out. <laughs> <laughs> you're relatively speaking you're yeah. you're a kid yeah the younger mosses and i was like uh it wasn't until i got that first reservoir then it like it kind of Clicked. I was stuck in this dungeon for a while. For a while, I remember when I first played it. But like when you compare it to the Forest Temple and the Goron Mines, it's I think substantially more. Yeah. Just going on. It's just. It's, 
it's it's good it's good stuff. I, yeah, I think they they did a good job of you know like you know the water temple has got to be a little complex. You know mm -hmm. that's that's become like the thing now. So right, it, it's still it's it's complex in the way. It's designed to still in a lot of ways that Twilight Princess dungeons are where you're you're looping back to this main chamber several times. And and they they make you think like there's so much you can do but there's really only like one place you can go usually. Right, yeah. You can return to other areas to get collectibles, which is a which mm -hmm. is kind of a staple of this and Wind Waker a little bit too. Yeah, and there's actually a lot of uh, I I screwed you. I mean, you already screwed it up once a little bit by getting that dungeon map. Uh huh. But there are a lot of tre treasure chests in this dungeon that yeah. like are right. They're screaming at you. Come open me. And I think I get a couple. I I definitely get a couple. Too. <laughs> like and and as I was getting them, I was going. I don't think I have to get this. I like so I looked at a map and I'm like, okay, where. Are the keys I need? I know there's like four keys I need to get. Uh huh. Like uh, I think I screwed up here. By the way, I went the wrong way for a second because I'm like, oh, I need to get a key. And you gotta go through. I think you gotta go through this. <laughs> yeah, you're. <laughs> we're both getting inner, inner. You know, left and right is mixed. These rooms give me trouble. You see, you know, when you're on top here. It, oh, okay. There's a lot of similarities between the left and the the, the, oh, the two yeah. sides of the dungeon, and um. I feel there's just a lot of repetition in the in the in the rooms that you're in. I always just remember here I here I messed up and I don't even know if it was a mistake, but I just like ignored that thing and I was like, "Wait a minute. I, I you got to pull that to open that gate." But I don't think you really need <laughs> on the way back, do you go the other I think the water wheel is open, so you can you go the go other down. way. You just go down. I usually just go down. But oh, or yeah, you can just fall down. But I I wasn't I couldn't remember, <laughs> so I was like, I guess I'll get it. Yeah. So kind of wasting a little bit of time here. Yeah, I'm pulling a little bit ahead right now, which is good because uh, there's some, uh, <laughs> uh, what do we call it? Now, by the way, you got to kill this guy. I don't think you got to kill this guy at all. No. I don't know why I felt. Oh, okay. Here's my ch here's my shot. Oh, actually, we're in the same exact place. But you didn't get the small key yet. Oh, you're right. I didn't. I don't know why I'm killing him, but. Oh, can you just go through the door right there? Yeah. Oh, okay. That's much faster than going through that middle room. That's where I go. Oh, I I need a key. I'm like, okay. I said like, I thought to myself like, I'm sure there's a key around here. Yeah. Like, yeah, there's gotta be one. <laughs> they they never put a key more than ten feet away from where you need one. Yeah. Okay, good. I'm glad I've got a little bit of an advantage here because there is some um, um, embarrassment. Oh, no, no, that was a few campaigns ago. The, the, the... Here's the problem, though, is you can't climb back up there, so I had to, like, go back oh, to this Oh, okay. Uh, good, good. This is more, uh, 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 laceration, or, uh lash lashings? <laughs> You're getting some lashings. I will have some lacerations coming. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. Wow, really hyping that up. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, I know I've stressed this a few times now. I've only actually played this dungeon one time in this mode okay so everything is still left and right to me is like confusing i always like every dungeon thus far i've had to look at a map before like i play just to make like okay, that's fantastic this is like why is this mirrored like i i god i want to get those two treasure chests right there but i chose not to <laughs> i wonder if did you get those treasure chests no th those can't help you <laughs> i think one's a compass I think one's water bombs. You're gonna slide right by me here. It'd be great <laughs> if we had like ghost mode. You know, I think I've that would be a great feature. <laughs> Alright, we gotta work on that. Eh? Hey, editors, let's <laughs> <laughs> frame by frame editing just to. <laughs> oh, worth it. I like this room actually, even though it's kind of a. Uh... It takes a little too long to get up top. I think they should have put like enemies here that aren't tektites that you fight, you know? Okay. Like just for some some drama of because you climb up it and then you just slide all the way down, you know. Yeah. Yeah. There's no chance I'm opening a chest that's like the little gold ones or whatever. <laughs> yeah. I think. Um, can you like just climb back up and just leap off? Oh, right there. I don't know. I just noticed that. Or I don't know. could you leap off? Yeah, because this is fun though. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> this is the way to do it. Yeah, I mean. 
they have this animation in the game. Is this the only time you ever slide down? A, like, um, that's a good question. What would you do uh, on a hill or something like that? I mean, you sh like shield surf, not shield surf. Oh yeah, you have that ice surfing with the with the Yetas later on. I guess that's yeah. Hmm. But Interesting. I fell all the Where'd way to the bottom go? here, so I gotta I gotta come back up a little bit. Oh, I think I messed up here a little bit. So this, I don't know why this got me disoriented here. Um, hey, you're probably gonna catch up right here. Like, Link, go into the door. Go into the door. Why did I not go into the door? Um, I'm like, you were probably remembering that like this is the way you go and do a bunch of stuff. Like, wait. well, I know, I know you gotta get the small key, and I'm like, wait, where's the? Wait, the small oh. key is not here. It's. I, I didn't remember a small key, but I did I did go in the right door. <laughs> okay, <laughs> there you go. Like I I uh, instinctively went in and turned left, but you have to go in the other door and turn right. Mm. You know. Maybe that. it's the mirror. Yeah, but you know that shouldn't that shouldn't throw you off. Well, you should know. Like it doesn't matter which version you get on this ride. And it's the and first you, door. It's the first door. I mean that that yeah. so now I'm just hitting this uh let's see this You're just <laughs> taking out your aggression. Yeah. So I think we're uh, we're all tied up now. Look at this. <laughs> uh, I still got to get the key, right? Or did no, you No, I'm getting the key now. Oh, perfect. Yeah. And not only that, there's another then I'm like, "Oh wait, there's this door here. Where where does this lead?" Oh, okay. So I'm like, "Let's go uh let's go explore this door." I think I remember that you weren't supposed to go this way. I'm like, wait. I'm like, I'm like, no, that's the boss. That's the boss. Don't go over there. Why are you going there? And then it, does this fade to black? Like, oh. Okay. So you're like, what a waste. Yeah. So all those hiccups you had earlier are... That's it. That's all it took. Yeah. A few a few small keys. Yeah. So you're winning right now, but it's okay. I think my middle game is good, actually. I hope. I don't really... I don't have, like, a perfect run by any means, so... Well, good. Well, nothing is perfect about, about <laughs> well, what we're doing here. <laughs> yeah, this is a well, you know, well-researched, polished planning. Uh, <laughs> I mean, we both usually run this <laughs> at the marathon. I have right? not ran this in in a few years. Oh, okay, okay. So I I kind of figured, like, <laughs> oh nice. I oh. figured that I remembered this. Did you have the whole? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, boots. I actually already had them equipped, I think. Oh, well, uh, yeah. This, this is a fun room for me here. Because I realize if you tap the button, you swim faster. I didn't know, I didn't know that before. Yeah. But then, like, I just, like, wee. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, hey, there's a chest, at least. <laughs> so, of course, I open it. <laughs> Did you, you have to open it at that point, right? <laughs> Did you think that that would benefit you in any way? I thought it was water bombs. I just assumed because there's a, there's a, oh. you need, you know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's pretty good. I mean, they put you right there. It's like, come on, man. Open, open me up. <laughs> See, I kind of figured that I knew this a lot better than you because I had played it the past couple years. Okay. I forgot how to look up. <laughs> uh, I, I have a little bit of that problem. How do you look up? I think you press the right joystick. Is it the right joystick? Eventually, I just pulled out the bow. Oh. Because I was like, I can't look up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you start killing the little toad polies, are they? I think I have a... You're I, catching up. Yeah. Uh, I don't think I... <laughs> yeah, it, oh, I'm like pulling bombs out. <laughs> Um, okay, good. Your, You're having a hard time. How's your battle? Yeah, oh, yeah, I forgot how to do this, too. And I'm like, what am I doing? Stop fighting these guys. <laughs> I'm like, all right, look up. I, I think I tried to back up as far as possible. There we go. I figured it out. All right, not that bad. How was your, your battle with this guy? <sighs> um, fine. <laughs> I have a couple scopes with him. Oh, good. You can beat him right away with bomb arrows, I believe. Oh, really? This is an incredibly short battle. Like, when he opens his tongue here... Oh, he didn't open his tongue for you. Not initially, no. It's after he falls down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right here. So, he, if you look here, you can pull out bomb arrows and shoot him 
like right there and it, it, and then he'll fall down and you can just beat him right there oh you can you can just repeat that like kind of endlessly interesting uh i know that strategy but then like look at this here <laughs> you can't get crushed he, he he just uh yeah he just flattened me and then that that, that kind of like throws the whole cycle off because you gotta you know fight these little whatever his little, the little guys toad polies i think they're called that would make sense what's this guy's name wart <laughs> no it's not wart <laughs> <laughs> wart i don't know argus <laughs> <laughs> Is it anything that has a bunch of little guys that's in water? Is it? You know, I was listening. Uh, I think it was. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I was listening on uh, Champions Cast a while back. They ranked the uh, the dungeons in A Link Between Worlds. And okay. They talked about. Is it Argus? Okay. Who yeah. She with the. He's got the the big eye with the little eyes all around. Yeah, him. and, and uh, well, that's multiple bosses in that in a link to the past. But you're talking about link between worlds. But yeah, with the hook shot. Yep. And they, it got me thinking because they said like, oh yeah, it's it's an alright boss, but it's like you always fight a guy like that when you get the hook shot. But then I thought about it, and you really don't. <laughs> like there's like th there's a guy like this who you fight to get the hook shot. By the way, I think this is the strategy I use. Like, so when he sticks his tongue right. out here, you do it. I missed it the first time, but I get it this time. I think you can just hit him like that. Oh wow! And then he falls back down, and it's a, and it's so you can do this like three times and, and kill him right away. I think I do it right away. Like, oh wow! Well, it's t too late now. Yeah. So for the future, the next time you find yourself in a in a Zelda warfare with somebody and you're in the <laughs> Lake Fed Temple, use that strategy. Yeah. Don't get crushed. All right, continue. Well, I I was just thinking like that's actually, I thought it was true too, but then it's really not true. There's only the two Arguses, and then there's the guy in Majora's Mask. But like you can, you don't really want to use the hook shot. Oh, uh, Wart. It, wart. Yeah. yeah. Like it's a similar. I that guy. I do. What's you that? Just, it, it you can throw bombs. You can throw the Zora boomerangs. Yeah. So there's a lot of that kind of boss, but there's really only two where you that are hookshot based. I see. Yeah. This one you get it from him. Right. So it's interesting. Yeah. There's not. There's not. Uh, well, I mean, the hookshot in of itself is not in all that many games. It's, yeah. No. Yeah. I guess not. I mean, there are variants of that in, like, Oracle of Ages, too, with the long hook, and there's the little Patra guys that are, you have to... That's true, that's true. So th there's enough, there's enough. <laughs> it happens from time to time. I like that Patra fight, by the way. It's great. <laughs> it, it's good. Okay, so you uh, are on your way, you're going, uh, I guess, this is the west side. Yeah, I'm on a mission. Or, I know you're going to the east side. You're going to the opposite side that you've already done. Mm, <laughs> yes. I, I know exactly where I'm going. I'm I'm on a mission at this point. Okay. All right, yeah, I'm, I'm making my way back to the main room. Uh, I know what I'm doing now. I don't think I... Uh, there's a... Uh, I think it's pretty smooth sailing for the foreseeable future. Oh, okay. So I think I might be able to... Uh, well, we'll see. Well, there's not really much to screw up here, I don't think. Or is mm, there? Yeah, no, I don't think so. I can't remember where I'm heading. You yeah. know what? I do screw up. I do screw up some stuff though. We're going to the second uh, reservoir here. Yeah. So again, it's. A, I feel like this is actually fairly straightforward. The dun the dungeon itself. I, I think you could forget when you or you could not think when you get the original one flowing to drop below, mm -hmm. but they do show a cutscene of it moving below. So right. Yeah. And you'd figure out just by exploring, by lack of options of where to go. So I've had a lot of trouble with these keys in the past. Th these, like, I think uh, I fall, like, at least once. There's, like, a few rooms that, or you come back to this room a few times. Like, I fall one time every time, oh, okay. I feel. Like, it's, it's just, it's required falling. <laughs> <laughs> I've I tried... Uh, you'll see it later. I try to take out some of them with the bow, but it's it's actually kind of hard in this game. I tried to. I naturally look left, of course. So you gotta go right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I tried to ignore the keys here. 
I'm like, all right, I don't need to deal with you guys. Just, just go. And then it hits oh, me. If they're if they're by me in target range, I'll oh oh. Now, now, now I'm like, in, yeah, I'm. Okay, that makes me feel a bit better for later. And then I like, I, 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 I don't know what that was. Wow. That was just the the. You said it was smooth sailing. I forgot about that. <laughs> uh, I think it's smooth sailing for now for the foreseeable future. Oh, okay. <laughs> What are you doing? Just staring at some waterfalls here? Uh, getting my bomb arrows. Okay. Oh, I ran out of arrows for a second. I don't oh. have any bomb, but, uh, you know, this is Twilight Princess. They, there's, yeah. If there's a puzzle that needs arrows, it's not more than five feet away. Like. Yeah, that's true. You, you Why, can, yeah, A Link Between Worlds was actually smart in just giving you that meter. Because at uh, some point it's like, who, who cares anymore if you have enough bombs or arrows, you know? Yeah, and that's. I do you think that's the new standard going forward. Yeah, like, I mean, the they, wild was no, not like that with arrows, but they with had bombs. arrows still. Yeah, they were like, okay, it's okay with with bombs, but arrows, uh, I don't know. It made more sense than that because you have all the types. You yeah. have the bomb arrows. So, and so he's like, I'm like, oh goodness, I need no air, more arrows. Where am I gonna find? Oh, they're right here. <laughs> like, <laughs> right. It, yeah, I mean that works too. Whatever you know. You could tell I'm menuing. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little. It's more covert than when I am. <laughs> yeah, your <yeah>, pause. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I wish it didn't make me feel bad for pausing. Why can't you climb on that thing? It, uh, you know, it was uh, shaking too fast. <laughs> I had to wait. <laughs> this some of these are you land like I. Not that one. There's one gap where you land very close to the edge, and it made me nervous that one of the guys was just going to come running at me and knock me off. Right, yeah. I think it's this one. Look how close you land. <laughs> I was oh. like, ah. Oh. <laughs> yeah, well, you got that Helmosaur. Do you like the Helmosaurs in this? <laughs> yeah, they're they're fun. Yeah, they're, they're kind of cute. This does a good job of, like, you get the claw shot, and now it kills everything. You can pull their masks off. That's a yeah. That's that's a classic. Mm -hmm. This guy's giving me trouble here. I still haven't fought one of those. I think I do up here though, because he's in the, he's like he ends up standing like right in front of the door. I don't think you need to fight him. No. He's uh, no. You never need to fight any any of those guys for some reason. You know when you play this game, just like casually, you I mean don't you fight like everything. Yeah, that's like that's the way you play Zelda. That's what most Zelda games are like. Twilight Princess, you don't fight anything. Generally. Well, most Zelda, well, not most Zelda games, but like, if you play A Link to the Past, it's like you have to fight the stuff. In a lot of rooms, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because like it's doors don't open until you kill all five enemies. Yeah. Like, I wonder how many enemies in this dungeon so are required. Look to at where he is. I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> very <laughs> annoying. I think that's like done on purpose because with the water, you know, it pushes them through the door. Mm -hmm. but I do find like the in 3D for some reason like the kill all enemies in a room to open it is kind of lame. Okay. Like uh, in Ocarina of Time in the Fire Temple, there's once after you get the hammer and you go back to the entrance and you go around. Oh, there's the a first... bunch of those rooms. The torch slug with the fire keys room. Yeah, I just I never. That's an annoying room. That's a really yeah. annoying room. Like, and I, I always hate, like, being in there and I kind of kill kill everything, but there's, like, keys flying around. I'm like, how do I open this door? <laughs> yeah. It's know. always the one keys that's just hiding somewhere <laughs> out of sight, you know, especially in the N64. You can't see anything. It's so dark. And... Oh, so here I see this uh, chest down here. <laughs> and I'm like, do I have I, to get that? I could have swore this was a this was a higher value rupee in the in the previous. <laughs> oh, game. so you know what it is too? It's it's. <laughs> I, I want to say I thought that was an orange rupee. Uh, it might have been at one point. Yeah, I was convinced it was a stamp. So you okay? Did I think I caught up a little bit because I'm in that room right now. So did you go the wrong way for a second to get out of here? Um, maybe. I wasn't I wasn't paying attention. Because look where I am here. <laughs> <laughs> this was uh we're, we're getting this one treasure chest. Wow. <laughs> uh, something really weird happens to me here though. Oh. And I lose uh lose a little bit of time. <laughs> and I don't know how this happens. Like, look at this. <laughs> <laughs> the wheel is going the other way. How does it avoid you? 
<laughs> How does it void you out? Wait, what? is it implying you got like crushed? Yes. That's so weird. I think I lost. You know, these you know these GameCube Zelda games. Like, what kind of uh, what kind of quality control is this? <laughs> now I'm like thinking, is it gonna happen again? <laughs> like, all right, let me wait. Yeah, be careful. <laughs> yeah. I was so stressed about this keys. Oh, did you fall down to the bottom? Did you have trouble doing that? No. I don't know if the game really wants you to be doing this. Like, is this is because there's no like clear place to do it. I don't. Think. No, you can go back up the vines you, uh, which you came. Oh, is that what you did? Yeah. Oh. That's what okay. you're supposed to do, I think. I think I usually just like I'm like ah uh, I think you can just jump. This is like kind of funny here because I'm getting beat it up, but it's like oh perfect. Whoa. <laughs> but then I immediately like. You fall. Like, well, not only fall. I think I get hit and then I fall like. Uh, like, I, cause I look at my health is really low too. Oh wow! Like, I, like <laughs> <laughs> where do you come back? At the entrance, um, but I had to use my fairy. I had a fairy in a bottle. Oh wow! So that was uh, I mean, this is a mess. Well, I'm having a hard time here too, but luckily the, we haven't been focusing on it. Yeah, yeah. Let's, okay, <laughs> let's look at. Okay, I, I just see you. Would you just keep missing this thing? Well, also, I, I was trying. I was wasting a ton of time. <laughs> I was wasting what a lot of time it? trying to snipe Keys. Oh, okay. Because I, oh, come on, because I really didn't want to get hit by them. Okay. And wow, yeah, this was, jeez, I could have caught up. You didn't. Yeah. <laughs> See here, and here are some more. Where I'm like, all right, I can take these guys down. Okay. Do you just tar You don't target them. Right? We're too far away, and this is. I've never thought about this before of like they they flap around it's kind of cool they flap around so erratically compared to like ocarina of time if you give me a room full of keys mm -hmm. i can snipe them all because they just fly so like in a right. straight path you know it's fun actually to shoot them why did you get off there because i was nervous about this keys yes all right i passed you <laughs> And I was like, I need more arrows. Oh, wow. Okay. All right, we got a lead change. Oh, wow. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, I'm going to say this is the most confusing room in the entire Legend of Zelda series. The whole series? The whole series, yes. I don't know about that. I don't know how to do this room. If you have a map and compass... The map is useless. No, I don't think the map is of any use. I don't fully agree. I used it here. I uh, oh god, this is this is embarrassing. All right, I'm glad I was winning going into this room because <laughs> I <laughs> I didn't have a great time with this room either. Okay, I I I know you have to blow this bomb. I'm like, okay, you gotta find find the boulder and there's the little bomb bomb mm -hmm. bling whatever that guy is the bomb fish like and uh, then you go through there and that's the way to go. I didn't remember that there's a second one you got to do. Oh, no, this is great, because I'm having a hard time, too. Okay, well, we'll see how long your hard time goes. <laughs> I'm, like, I'm like going down this corridor 100% knowing I'm not supposed to go down this corridor. You ever have that feeling? I think I, I, think I do the same thing <laughs> as you. Oh, really? And you go into this, like, I'm like, no, this is where you come out of. I, like, because... <laughs> that was a great bomb right there. <laughs> okay, yeah. I'm like, okay, no, no, you, you don't do this. Like, I, you, I'm like, come on, Moss, turn it on. Yeah, so I go You're, down this corridor. Do you go into the room too? And I and I start to think, because I I remember. Okay, you go around and you claw shot your way down. Yes, I remembered that. And you land in the circular room. Yes. And then as soon as I saw that, I was like. <laughs> Yeah, that's exactly what I... I love this. We, like, and I, we both got that treasure chest. We both went into the wrong room. I, and I was thinking here, isn't... This is not the... See, I wasted so much more time in this room. Oh, this is great. Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> I was thinking, yeah, that's... This is the claw shot. Uh, this is our first time playing this game, by the way. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, all right, this is... Yeah, now I'm I, I don't know what I'm doing at this point. I think I go back to the entrance. <laughs> it's you know, it's another way that they get you thinking you're going in a loop. <laughs> well, this one what's what's t 
tough about it is that there's layers of of like tunnels mm -hmm. so it's not just like there's the entrance the middle and the end there's like the you know the, the this is where i start using the map though okay because i go okay i can see here now where the path to the circular room is it's not like perfect that, that's what you need to find that uh. the, like i i missed that oh so i have i pulled ahead yes yeah i um I, I, I used to like remember. Okay, there's two boulders. You got to blow up two boulders. That's the way to think about this room. Mm -hmm. Unless you bol uh, blow up two boulders, don't progress. <laughs> so I'm. I was looking there, going, okay. I need to get to above the area I was. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, like I. I feel like the once you know where not to go, the map actually is okay. I kept like looking at the room. I'm like, all right, how do I get there? Can I get on top oh, wow. of this ledge? No, I, I can't get on this. I'm, I'm sure you can glitch and get on top of that ledge. Actually, like now that I think about it, this is fantastic failure. Actually, oh, no, this is this is deep cut lacerations right here. I felt bad, and then I think there's still a little bit. I think I screw up. <laughs> like this is not. I'm not. I'm not there yet. Like, I'm no. Not, <laughs> I'm like. I'm like, how do I get to this door? I could see the door. Come on, door. <laughs> yeah. You've got enough clues here, I think. To... No, like, I'm like, are you even, like, allowed to be up here? Like, <laughs> <laughs> allowed. <laughs> I'm like, oh, wait, do you got to go around here? Oh, I'm like, ah, like, there, there's, like, four different occasions where I'm like, oh, okay, I got it. Oh, wait, no, this is not it. <laughs> I'm, like, I'm like, what is this area? Like, oh, wait. It's is... the gold rupee area. <laughs> I think, am I winning in rupees? Uh, how many? <laughs> <laughs> wow. Yeah, this is. Um, this is the this is the make or break moment. We we've gone. Uh, oh, do you, you gotta find it here. I think. Uh, do I get this treasure chest? <laughs> <laughs> Just if all else fails, start opening treasure chests. <laughs> yeah, there's gonna. I think I see the the yeah. Okay. This so is where I started. Like, ah, oh, God. This is where it just hit me. Like. You're supposed to blow up two things. Blow up two things. So. Oh, you know, I still have some mistakes. More mistakes were made. Yeah, check this out. <laughs> oh, oh, you just fall into the abyss here? Uh, sort of, yeah. I'm gonna. You got me going. <laughs> 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 yeah. <laughs> I don't know why I thought that would work. That's, well, that's fantastic. I, uh, or I made it to the door. <laughs> so we, uh, okay. I think I was in this room for nine minutes, maybe. <laughs> this is the majority of your run was in this room. Yeah. Do you kill this guy? Uh, no, I don't think so. <laughs> oh, I kill him. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, did you kill him? No. <laughs> okay. So I want those arrows. That you should... <laughs> <laughs> no, you're stuck now. If only you could swing. If only you could grapple. Oh. Wouldn't yeah. that be cool? That, that was in uh, Wind Waker. Yeah. They need to make the uh, combined hookshot grappling hook. Is that a... I mean, most grappling hooks, I think, are hookshot. Like, yeah. I mean, like Phantom Hourglass, you can... Well, no, Phantom Hourglass, you can't... It doesn't pull you to the spot, though, you know? That's what I want. Yeah. Well, it does, but it doesn't. you can't swing on it. Mm, right. Yeah, there's no... They need to get both mechanics in one. Swinging is only in uh, Wind Waker and Spirit Tracks. Is there any other swinging? Are, the, are those the only games with swinging? Uh, Skyward Sword, I guess. How do with you swim? swim? Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, so that has both. That has swinging and grappling, but it's not the same item. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think I think we can streamline things a bit and make it one item. Okay. <laughs> So Breath you didn't. Of the wild too. You didn't get a fairy. Oh, you don't have. A, you don't need a fairy. No. Because you. Have. I didn't <laughs> spend it. <laughs> you, you didn't. Okay. I love how long you have to fall here. Actually. Uh, you know, I wasn't sure if iron boots or you, like, swim downward. I don't know what was the fastest, fastest route. I just stuck with the boots. You know, when you're in this massive, when you're in a massive like, lake and you got to swim down about two hundred feet, what is your? Uh, you know, mode of <laughs> swimming. I would, yeah, I would go with uh, strap the boots to my feet. I don't think I would. <laughs> <laughs> you have a Zora tunic on there. <laughs> Hopefully. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> Otherwise, uh, I wouldn't go down, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> this is some deep, uh, deep sea. If I saw this in real life, I would, I would die. <laughs> well, yeah, but that's why you have fairies. Huh? Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Um, this How? this fight is interesting. Did he grab you? No. <laughs> no. I feel like I've gotten gra like I fought him many times before and been grabbed every time. Okay. Multiple times. Okay. How many times you got you got hit him? I think one time and he starts spitting bombs at you. Yeah, it's kind of. Um, is it random where he is located? Oh, you keep hitting his hands. That's great. I didn't know you can do that. I didn't either. Is it? Is that it? He's coming out. Yeah. Wow, you destroyed him. <laughs> Whoa. It's kind of anticlimactic a little bit. Yeah. Oh God, he crushes me. It's not like. Oh. Uh, I'm not even. Gonna I think get you've it. spoiled the. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he. Yeah. I have a really good second phase that we will never see, though. <laughs> I mean, we can watch it if you want. Uh, <laughs> This phase, <laughs> this boss, this phase is like cool visually, but it's, it's not really fun. <laughs> that is, um, I feel a lot of what makes the Twilight Princess bosses fun is the visuals. It's just more of a... The grandness of it all. Though when, yeah, when you're swimming by him and you like see his body, it looks really cool and intimidating. Yeah. But even like, like... Everything in Twilight Princess, the scale is just so much bigger. Mm -hmm. So Diababa's like this full room, like, like up until, like, there's not that many bosses that are that, like, large. You know, Firus is big. This guy's, you see, the, he's like the largest boss in the Zelda series up until this point, I think. Yeah, it's really scary. Yeah. When you see the fins and whatever. I like the music for this boss too. Mm -hmm. it, I like this boss. Actually, I do. I, I this first phase not so much, but yeah. Okay, this is so. This is how uh, what not to do in this spot. Like, I. What do you do? I, well, I'm like, where is his eye? Okay, there it is. I can't grab it. I, I like. Uh, oh my goodness. Yeah, apparently you can hit the. I think I got lucky a little bit. Okay. Because I. Wow. I wasn't trying to avoid the arms. They just never got me. So one thing I don't I don't get about this dungeon, you are the dungeon is at the bottom of a lake. Uh -huh. We are now in a room at the bottom of the dungeon, which is already at the bottom. So now we're really, really, really yeah. deep. We're super deep. So he hits a wall, and the water gets sucked. Up. Where is this water going? <laughs> you know, it's uh, this is a room that they can drain somehow. It's being put out into the lake, I guess. The lake is above you <laughs> by a, a substantial margin at this point. Maybe there's more lake Yeah. <laughs> below the lake. Yeah. I don't know. Wow. All right. Well, uh, congratulations on your lake bed. Uh, this, was, uh, that was, this was a lashing. <laughs> I think I get grabbed again. I don't even think we'll see the second phase here. Wow. But, uh, all right, so what's the score? What did we agree I upon? think I'm winning. You're winning? It's, uh... 20, 20 to 4. Uh, <laughs> let's be realistic here. <laughs> Don't make up numbers just for the sake of padding your score. Come on. Where's this, this, this gamesmanship here? Well, we'll let the numbers decide. Yeah, I, I'm sure it's on the screen somewhere. I'm sure. Yeah. I don't I don't look at these, but I'm sure the numbers are there yeah. somewhere. <laughs> We're, we are going to... There is a pretty cool cutscene after this, but uh, that will have to wait. <laughs> you can so, you know, go look it up. Yeah. You got the... All right, we made it to the phase two, so... Okay, okay. <laughs> I, this wasn't as bad. I After beating this, I went up to you. I'm like, man, I think if I played this back, I can beat this by, like, five, six, seven minutes, I think. Yeah, that's probably true. I mean, it would just be those, that one room alone. The one, right? but but then like the the Deku Toad, I think that's his name. Mm -hmm. That's the name of the boss. But going the wrong way. But <laughs> all right. Well, thanks for watching, guys, and we will see you next time.